looking for punishes and finding them. Nice slide there from Geki. Gonna look to start pushing the pace in neutral. Stands still for a minute. Gets one whiff punish and then gets his slide punish. Nice confirm from James Bond 911. Target combo into DP. Geki using the slide very liberally to get away from the pressure. Stand short on the cross under. Crouch strong doesn't convert. V reversal and back throw. Nicely done there from PB Geki to get around all of that Fuma Shuriken mix up. The cross under into the stand short once again. No trip guard for James Bond 911 means a solid finish in round number one for Geki. Misses the Rida on the EX Kunai, but lands a couple of shots. Does James Bond 911? ASE doesn't find the mark. Nice whiff punish there from Kenny. Crouch strong. Gets the punish on the Fierce as well. On the jump over, converts into DP. Jumps out of the corner, does Geki. Geki gonna look to hold this pressure. Activates Allegrias, gonna look for a button to punish on Kenny. First up, maintain corner pressure. Neutral jump, cross up, jump, mix up for PB Geki. And punishes the target combo. Should be able to find a finish here. Allegrias into critical art. Bloody Rain Ninja Battle 1 by the Spaniard. 1-0 for Geki. Game number two now. Geki looking to continue to push the pace, push the dominance. Nice air to air, stays in front as James Bond 911 gets a full punish out of that one. Barcelona, an anti air and a reload of a kunai. I don't know if that was what James Bond 911 wanted, but the back medium punch does cover both of those options, I believe, for Ibuki over that flying Barcelona attack. Now all pressure coming from James Bond 911. Jumps over the fierce and gets another convert. Command dash through the V reversal to make sure that he was still meaty on recovery regardless. Good recognition from James Bond 911. EX Kunai into Rhina. Start pushing towards the corner and put on the pressure. V skill to build that Fuma Shuriken. Just outside of range. Going to try to use it again. Find a punish. Good confirm from James Bond 911. Went for the reset. Ready for it was Geki. Whiff punish with that Buster Claw. Goes for the Barcelona, was looking for the uh, neutral jump there, didn't quite find it. Oh, Raida, spent Kunai, doesn't find the finish there. Went for some style points. No more Kunai for James Bond 911. And the FBA on the right side stays and crosses up. Nicely done from Geki to take that round. Looking to take a 2-0 lead over James Bond 911. The anti-air trades, the Buster Claw stance switch into the forward throw. And no checks from James Bond 911. Those are actually minus. Neutral jump gets caught. Geki gets the reset on standing up as well. Very, very strange scenario off of EX FBA. And another stun for Geki. Buster Claw to finish that one off. And he's got a 2-0 lead. Solid work from P.B. Geki, who of course is preparing for Evolution 2018. Round one. Game number three, looking for the sweep. James Bond 911 on the other side, looking to recover. V-Skill fully charged, gonna build some of that to start. FBA shorted, jockeying in neutral, jump uh, forward, finds the mark there for Geki. Ninja Roundhouse lands for Ibuki. The command dash stays in front. Target combo in to DP. On the other side of that, Geki with the wake up short finds a punish. Low forward will also get a punish and the rolling attack will get you to the corner. Into the stance switch and throw. Kenny has yet to deal with this stance switch and a beautiful shimmy from the student of the shimmy Kami. And that flying Izuna drop EX gets it done for Geki. Round two. Point. 
Pushing forward, the throw bait this time from James Bond 911 on the overhead. Gonna push towards the corner. Second straight throw bait. Target combo into DP for damage. Third straight throw bait. Gonna find the stun. Big time damage. Which side are you staying on? Another throw bait. Let me show you how this is done, young man. Unblockable kunai cross up, fake cross up, real cross up. Set up from James Bond 911. Yet Kunai, Ryda, start pushing towards the corner. Does James Bond 911? Not gonna let it go this easy. The stand switch not punished once again. Instead, looking for whiff punishes is Geki, and now he's getting in trouble trying to out footsie the veteran Kenny. But Kenny fails the Ryda on that one. Yikes, slide punish. Full damage is what James Bond 911 is going for, but full resources on the side of Geki. Activates Allegrias on an unsafe position. Goes for the EXFBA, finds the Claw Strike. Buster Claw juggles, doesn't finish. Watch out for the mix-up. Stays in front with the Command Dash. Nice block from Geki, good recognition. EX Kudai trying to put on the pressure. Goes for Allegrias, gets caught. Goes for Wake Up. PB Special, can he find damage enough to kill? Not quite, one more touch for either, but all the meter on the side of James Bond 911. Geki finds the overhead and we'll move on to losers. Semi-final, Geki will have to stay seated in his chair to take on NSLD. Armor GG, Tagashi Azrael here with you. We are moving on. Loser's side top four.